This video is made for mature audiences. Parental discretion is strongly advised. Thank you. Hey ladies and gentlemen, this is Star Phoenix. How are you all doing today? Uh, we're going to be bringing you another promo uh, indie game called Moss Destruction. It's a little bit of a twin stick style shooting game. Uh, you control a little robot thing called a boss and basically just roll around, blow stuff up, pick up weapons, and progress through the uh, the game and levels. Um, it was a pretty interesting game when I did my test on it. I, I kind of uh, like the way it was set up. It's pretty simple and straightforward. Um, if anybody ever seen me play Devader when I did my Devader uh, playthrough some time ago, it's kind of similar feel, but um, instead of being just like a big map that you're constantly circling around, it's like a little cavern style map where you're looking for warp points to make an exit goal. Um, yeah, so it's a little bit of a roguelike thing. Some of it's procedurally generated, so the map can change its look every time you load up. Um, Monst the the enemies can change, the weapons can change, so and um, there's supposed to be a couple of different worlds and you know, a couple of boss characters and things like that, so and uh, there there's a ranking there, there's a way to like rank up your dude, get more you know get more um, what they call mosses, which are like the, uh, the the character you control and then you can pick up um, things for permanent upgrades. So I'm planning on probably about a half hour to 45 minutes here. Probably it's probably gonna be close to 45 minutes. But hey, you guys, kick back and relax now. Um, again, I'm gonna say I tried the controller support. Um, controller support. I don't know if it's Steam or not. Like a lot of these games say controller support and the controller doesn't work. And I'm kind of wondering if it's Steam now or not, or if the games really don't have controller support. But like, the controller unfortunately didn't work for me, so I'm using mouse and keyboard. But mouse and keyboard is actually probably better for this game, just based on um, my past experience with twin stick shooters like this. So. All right, guys, we'll hop in. So you hit play. You get you have these worlds. So you have like I have desert. I haven't unlocked these other two worlds yet because I haven't played that long. But, and there's also day-night cycles. And then you have the mosses, uh, the heroes. <clears throat> this one it tells you kind of who they are um, and what they pilot. So you know, you get the chicken there. Um, and then you have other heroes that are classified because they haven't unlocked them yet. Uh, you can mod your mech out. But it requires uh, these green crystal things here, which I've only got three of. So you can do a variety of things to improve the performance of your mech. You can also purchase cartridges uh, if you've bought any and add them in, which will give you permanent boosts. I don't have any because uh, you know we don't we didn't. We don't have enough of the in-game currency to do it. Alright, so let's go. Hit play. Drop in level 1. You always start at level 1, so even if you progressed higher. So yeah, you see we got this uh, ability to 360 with the mouse in WASD. Right mouse you have a melee, left mouse you have a gun. So you, you said the point is you just go through here, look for stuff like that, shoot it, try to collect power-ups. Poking field. And then we have, you know, now I can use the poking field if I want to. You do take damage, so if you take too much damage, you blow up. So you want to make sure you don't blow up. And you do run out of bullets, so you want to make sure that you know you're not just spamming shots. This right here is a shop. This is where you can you get the green crystal to purchase stuff. We've only got 
freeze so he can't do anything. And then the other thing we're looking for is, um, uh, and that's the other thing we're looking for, is the exit. I'm going to go hunt around a little bit. Now you got to be careful because the enemies can't respawn. What the hell? What the devil is that thing? Oh, I get to do double damage. Picked up something. Whoa, there is some stuff over here. And you can hold down the mouse button to get automatic fire. Bazooka. Whoa, what the heck? I've not seen this many things before. And then you can get the shotgun to give yourself some more. Wow. They keep coming back. Alright, let's get out of here. So you can switch between your basic shooter and your shotgun. Oh boy, I'm taking damage. Ah! Where is everything coming from? And I just died. <laughs> Revenge, go back in. Yeah, I think when it gets dark, like, stuff starts popping out more. So you have to be careful with that. I was not expecting that, though. Yeah, those little these those little slime pools, they actually do damage you if you walk into them. It's like a sort of like a, a last ditch defense. Whoa! Alright, we're just gonna go to the next level. I left something behind. Level 2! And stuff does get harder as you go along, so you want to try to make sure you have a couple of extra weapons and you have some power-ups. Whoa, this thing's got shields. Yeah, horrify. Everything becomes a spider when you do that by accident. <laughs> some of the power-ups are good, some of them are bad. Like that one, like I said, makes everything look like a giant spider. Wow, this thing's taking a lot of damage. Holy crow. Wow! Let's see what number one does. Solar multiplicator will grant Chrysol drop with every kill. Oh, cool. So I can get green stuff. Those green things. I need that. Our little key shooter is not doing enough damage. Wow, that didn't last long, did it? I only got two. And if you haven't been somewhere yet, it has that fog. Oh! To let you know. Alright, we're just gonna go ahead and go to the next level. Uh oh. Yeah, night, night time. I gotta get out of here.
Oh, jeez. What did I do to myself? Oh, God, this is getting bad. Ah! <laughs> Revenge. Yep, start over. Level one again. Yeah, I, I let it. I let the. I let the nighttime catch up to me there, unfortunately. So that was my own fault. Get an achievement for killing two with one slice. Oh, nice. Nice. Oh, where's the way out? Oh, there it is. Let's grab this. I don't know what it does, but we'll find out. I'll pop one of them. That's when I get in here. Oh, right two! Oh, cool! Weapon crates will contain two weapons. Decreases incoming ranged attack damage by one, but cannot decrease it below one. Only one armor can be obtained in the same run. Every third melee kill adds five to one of your ammo counters. You can always select supply drops to restore your health. Oh. Uh. Okay, I'll take the supply drop. That sounds good. I don't know how to use it. <laughs> Alright. Eclipse. Oh, great. I just... I just eclipsed myself. That was fun. I don't have another gun. Protein pus. Uh, okay. changed. Whoa, spider. I'm not horrified, though. This must be real, then. Or, oh, great, I am horrified now. So now everything's a spider. Except the spider is a spider. Ow. Oh, great. I'm jammed. <laughs> oh, that was no fun. Lead boots, oh great, now I'm slow. I feel like 
all of these things are negative. Ow. Five explosive? What? Mr. Beam. Oh, nice. Well, let's see. Can I get anything to shop? Oh, what's this? Power dash. A short range dash. Hmm. X ray spy glasses. Savvy shot. Oh, this is one of those ones. Okay, well. Oh, you know, I'm gonna. Oh, sorry, guys. I'm gonna get this. Now, I don't know how to use that. Let me see. Where are my uh, control settings here? Um, uh, okay, I guess it's not going to tell me. I guess it'll tell me at some point. Whoa! Nice. Um, okay. This is not cool. Uh, whoa, okay, okay. Not, not cool, not cool! I'm out of ammo. Oh god, I'm out of ammo. Ah! Oh god, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die! Ah! <laughs> Mistakes were made. <laughs> Mistakes were made, guys! Oh my god. And we gotta start with level 1 again. Alright, so... It doesn't tell me how to use my dash, though. How do you find out what the rest of your keybinds are? Oh, it's a grenade launcher. Oh, hold on. I'll grab that. We'll take a grenade launcher. Wormify. Oh, great. And, oh god, my grenade launcher, I blew myself up. Oops. Alright, so apparently, uh... Self-destruction is a thing. Didn't know that. I didn't blow myself up last time, so... Oh, God. <laughs> Inverse servos. That wasn't cool. Alright, I only got 3 HP. Actually, kind of a hard game. I don't know if it's just because I'm bad at it or if it's generally hard. Well, there's a shop there. Heat baller. What's the heat baller? Oh, okay. It's like a rocket launcher. Ow. 
Okay. So apparently it's a crazy rapid fire fireball launcher. Cool. Oh, pet? Oh, I didn't mean to pick that. Personal escort. Okay, I don't know what the rest of it does. So. Oh, we have a pet. Oh boy, I'm out of ammo. Oh, what do we got here? Mini gun? Hello. I can't go that way. Okay. We have a mini gun. This sounds fun. Okay. Okay. What is this? Quad damage? What? Key cards. Use them to open the gates of the same color. Oh. Okay. So, oh, I can open that, that blue gate over here. Huh? And I just blew myself up. Rip. <laughs> Rip. Start over. Damage buff. Nice. Alright. Was that the way out that we passed? Yeah. We'll go ahead and just hit it. Okay, so there's different ammo for everything. I see now. That's what all that is. I'm understanding this now. So energy ammo, explosive ammo, fire ammo. Okay, I see. Oh great, I eclipsed myself. Yeah. Storage malfunction renders the current inventory slot out of order until the end of the level. Oh, so I can't get any more bullets. Oops. Oh, I can't pick up the extra ball. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm out. I see. I see. I see. I see. I see. Titanium plate around the assault rifle does one damage. The boosted over ooze trampling system grants you faster movement, lets you walk over hazardous puddles. Every seventh range kill transfuses one HP to you up to your. Oh, cool. okay. That one sounds good. So the more I kill the more I can heal as long as I do it with my gun. Sounds good.
More damage! What do we... The Flamer! Okay. Uh oh. Bit of a close range thing, but... Okay. Well, let's see if we can get anything to shop. Nope, we can't. I got no uh, none of those green things left. Alright, let's get out of here before it turns dark on us and we get destroyed. Uh, okay. I'll grab those and get out of here. Let's go. <laughs> so we have damage buff, we know that for sure. Okay, we can, let's see, was it? Considerably reduce shot spread of weapons. Uh... Every third melee kill. Uh, pet seemed like kind of a cool thing before, so we'll use that again. It seemed to do some good stuff for us. Oh wow, we got the key card. I'm out of HP again. Dang it. <laughs> Seem to be dying a lot here, guys. I think the biggest problem I have is I can't find a good secondary weapon. I need to really find a good secondary weapon. Like something that will I can rely on. I mean I like I like this starting rifle, but I feel like it's like That or maybe I don't melee enough, who knows. Health regen, oh nice. Oh crap, I forgot. <laughs> God, I retinal poisoned myself and I reversed my servos. <laughs> Arms dealer. Weapons crate will contain two weapons. Uh, shield keeps common enemies from deploying shields. Decreases incoming melee damage by two. I like the shield disruptor. Those shields are annoying. Whoa! 
My grenade rebounded into me. Lol. <laughs> Self-destruction again, guys. Oh, boy. damage All right, there's the arms dealer but I can't use them Eclipse myself. Oh boy. Okay, we're definitely not going to. Oh wait a minute. That's the. The other one was the exit. Wait. I thought that was the arms dealer. Okay. Great. So now we gotta. Run. Yeah, I'm not gonna take it. I've been blowing myself up too much. So we gotta hurry then. Run. Hey, we got all our health back. up again guys Ugh. I didn't take the grenade launcher I probably could have used it there oh well it's actually not a bad game I mean it's a little difficult just because it's like well it's a little difficult just overall but I kind of like that difficulty Energy module. Okay. Wormify. Alright. Let's just go to the next level. with me. Okay, whatever it was, I chopped them up. Oh, retinal no poison. Yikes. myself so let's not deal with the spiders <laughs> rules out the generation of alien tech shards with negative effects okay trap scan we'll do that Okay, key card. I need another weapon though, like real bad. Ah, spider! Oh, geez. Dang 
That is a... Du oh, double damage. Okay, cool. Ouch. Coin gun? What the hell? Oh! Okay. I can't buy anything. Oh, good, I locked it. Uh, one HP. That's not cool. Okay. Oh, that's nice. was not cool. I almost died. <laughs> it got dark again. Okay, so that gun's really slow, but the bullets kind of jump around everywhere. That's actually kind of nice. Twilight Knight grants 15% boost to speed and fire after sunset. Ooh. Let's go with that shield disruptor, though. I'll hope, hopefully, yeah, that doesn't come back to bite me. Nope. Twilight Knight. Never mind. <laughs> Alright, I took Twilight... Oh, I got two of them, so I got the shield disruptor and Twilight Knight. Alright, that's good. Cool. Protein. Oh, it gives you more health. Oh, crap. Ah! Oh, that was mine. <laughs> well, let's see. Did I pick up enough to matter? No. I only got three, so... All right, I need a blue key card. Cloaking field. Yes, please. Alright, so it's after sunset now. Oh, bye! I hope I don't regret losing the point gun. Give me a supply drop. gun. Oh. I need a red key card. Oh. 
Oh, nice. Insta kill, huh? That was nice. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, guys, I've officially made it. Oh. Further than I've ever made it. Take the pet. It's pretty interesting. Uh oh. What? A boss! Oh! -ho! And I'm dead! <laughs> I nuked myself! <laughs> oh boy. Finally get up to the boss. Hey Sora, what's up? How's it going, man? Nice, I finally get up to the boss. I picked up the, like, a spread missile gun and I nuked myself. I love it. Back to level one, guys. Start over. Great. Already taking damage. Oh, great. <laughs> I jammed my weapons. Lovely. <laughs> Alright, so staying until nightfall does give you the advantage of getting more stuff. But it comes at a cost. Oh, great. I'm lead boots. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, that was the first time I've run into the boss, so I didn't know what to expect. Alright, so let's see. Trap scan. Every third melee kill gives you a little bit of ammo. Boost rate of fire by 33% also has ammo consumption of the minigun. That's assuming I find the minigun. I'll take this one because that, keep, that keeps the negative side effects from those bubbles so I'd rather have that that worked out really well so that's actually a really good perk to pick up because then I know all the ones I pick up aren't going to destroy me <laughs> I'm not going to get like weird neural scans or something like that what do we got oh cool wormify so all the all the monsters become worms oh what's this Oh, let's see. What do we got? I got ten. Huh? What do we? What can we buy here? Medical degree, passive. Med kits heal one extra HP. Okay. Passive melee rate is two times as fast. Yes, please. I think I have to equip that though. Oh, I kind of like this gun. If I hit, there we go. Oh, this is one I have to... This is semi-automatic. Okay. Oh, let's see. What's that? Push the tempo! Woohoo!
plasma gun? Uh... Disc is a rare passive safety item. If kept in the inventory, it will activate automatically upon the first incoming lethal blow instead of dying. It fills half the light. Oh! So it's a re raise. So now I have re raise. Okay. Uh, get, get, get out of my face. Get out of my face. I don't want to waste my re raise. Uh, oh, bazooka. Oh god, I can't get it. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> I want that bazooka, but I couldn't get near it. And I used up my re-race. Ay ay ay. Yes, supply drop, please. And uh an orb that circles around you bends the trajectory of incoming bullets. And they can damage the enemies. The blast radius of explosive weapon yeah. Yeah, no, thank you. Alright. Yeah, let's get Roto node. That sounds fine. <laughs> Bullet bending. Now I can matrix the bullets. That sounds fine. But I got two. I think I got two energy weapons. I gotta replace some. Replace it somehow. What's this? Oh, nice! Instant kill. Oh, great, they got shields! Good, I got damage buff now. Yeah, I definitely need a better weapon. The point gun! Please. I like this little gun. It's a little slow, but I like it. All right, there's the exit. Don't want to screw around. Oh, let me grab this at least. Let's go. And I've got a power up. I'm gonna burn it right when I get in here. A sniper rifle? Um, okay. Oh. Okay. I thought I picked up the blue key card. What? Oh. Okay. Alright, sniper rifle may not be so good. Oh, 
Go away. All right, let's get out of here. Let's get night. Shotgun. I don't want that though. Let me get out of here. Oh, I took a lot of damage getting out of there. Ow! Alright, so sniper rifle. Eh. Slows down hostile projectiles. Improved. Considerably reduces shot spread of weapons against the slight... Okay, the homing rocket thing. Uh, shield disruptor. Flame weapons consume less fuel and their damage increases. I'm going to go with this... Oh, let's see. Do I need health? Yeah, I should get this for health. Okay, so ammo supply is basically like you just give yourself stuff at the start of the level to boost you. Oh, okay, we got the red key card. And we got the blue key card. Okay. Okay, we'll take that instead. Oh, we got the backup thing. Whoa. Oh, what do we got here? I don't have enough. What's this? Oh, the T-Gun! Uh... Yes, please. Consider yourself terminated. Oh yeah, let's get out of here. So I have damage buff to start off with too. I might hold, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold on to it. Oh, boss! Yeah, I'm gonna burn it. Yeah, we got the boss, boys. Woohoo! Pop jam. Complete. Oh wow! Completion time: enemies killed, kills per minute twelve. Favored weapon. Nice. Hell yeah! Now let's see what we got. 
Rank eight. Yeah, I need I need health, so I'm gonna get that. Thunderstruck gives the zapper a slight chance to stun enemies. Makes grenade launch launch grenades explode automatically to enemies within a blasting range. Reduces the cooldown of active cartridges by one third. Oh, it must be like the the well. Level 7. Ooh. Are we on a new world? Ooh, check out this music. <laughs> oh, wow. We got a flamer at the start. Yeah. Oh. Oh, my God. This is a maze. What? Okay, yeah, I think my pong, my ping gun is going to do me better here. I can bounce it around corners. I don't want that. Oh, that's one of those green things. I gotta pick that up. See if we can buy anything. Oh wow, we got 24? Grants an additional active slot for every hero. Okay. Don't know what that does yet, but... I'm out of ammo. Oh, crap. OK. 
Okay, um... How do I get out of here, then? I feel like I walked around in one big circle. And I'm dead. <laughs> Lol. I didn't unlock. Oh, I did. I unlocked it. The Blue Wilderness. I have. I have the next level. Okay, cool. So I don't have to start over from the desert if I don't want to. All right. Well, guys, overall, yeah, it's a, it's a, that's a, that's actually a fun game. It's hard. Um, I will say that I'm glad that they put that in there so you can get a boost to another world, so you don't have to start over at the beginning. So eventually, when you do kill the boss, you do get access to the next world. So I like that. Uh, those power-ups, the the options for the power-ups are pretty cool. They, they said that roguelike element. Um, kind of reminiscent of when I played like, uh, like. Nova Drift and a couple other games. So. I actually think it's fun. Um, it's a like I say, it can get a little chaotic though. Like the sunset thing definitely adds like a massive amount of difficulty, but it's like a risk reward thing because it seemed like I got a lot of extra stuff when I was fighting at night. Um, but yeah, guys, if you feel interested in the game, uh, like I said it's available on Steam. Uh, it's been out since March of last year, and it's uh, $9.99. Um, I think for the way the game plays, um, I think for the way the game plays, $9.99 is about the upper limit of what I would pay for the game, honestly. Like, if you guys, you know, were to wait and maybe catch it on sale or maybe catch it on Humble Bundle sometime. It might be a good option, but if you feel like it's, you know, it's this is your jam, yeah, go pick it up, guys, and, uh, you know, help support the developer there. But anyway, everybody on Twitch, stick around. We've got more gameplay coming up. Everybody else, of course, on YouTube and Facebook, as always, you know, remember to like and share. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of the game video. All the information for the developer in the game will be in the description box as well. And, uh, Thank you very much, everybody, for watching. Catch you on the next promo.